really excited to get the call. Well, no, you are. Don't, don't take anything for granted. You know, we need to somebody. Do it. Come on, you can 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 so what we've done today, we just cooked some wonderful, wonderful stir-fried uh, chicken uh, with macaroni and then one dishes with rice. And just bagging up, giving them some crackers. We got some water and, um, and a few little snacks. You know, there's some homeless. You know, we're in L.A. and there's so much devastation and homeless out here. And we're thankful and grateful that, um, that we're able to do this because we're looking for big things to happen in our lives. You know, people are blessing and donating $10,000 to us and, and, you know, different organizations. So this is just nothing. This is a little thing that at least we can do. Let's give how we can. And, and it's the heart that God looks on. So make sure you uh, take the, all the attention off of you. Because I've been talking to friends and they're like, my nephew committed suicide. My so-and-so got killed in a car. You know, people are dying. COVID is out there running rampant and all, and we're just being mindful to stay focused, to continue to put God first, continue to love while you can, and you never know. You never know what you, uh, God is getting us in, in store, getting us ready for. So I'm thankful and grateful that I'm here with Doug. Uh, he is a um, volunteer. We all volunteer. But we're partnering up because we want to get our food truck so that we can feed the homeless. He's from Kenya. He and his wife, Denise, who is another designer, beautiful, beautiful family, got one little son and uh, that speaks languages, Swahili and all. That's what I'm talking about. Make sure your children invest in their brain, you know. Give them something that's going to um, help them to diversify, you know, and set them above the rest. You know, not just uh, doing this all day on the thing, playing games that's not going to benefit them unless they're going to design their own. But, you know, just do the best that you can, pray without ceasing. My mother always would say, uh, Carol, she said, when your children are young, they're on your um, lap, but when they get older, they're on your heart. And I tell you, everybody's on our hearts right now because, you know, the Black Lives Matter movement is going on. And we here, we've got it right here. Black Lives Matter, y'all, make sure you uh, be mindful of what that really, really means. You know, because some people just out playing games with it and utilizing it, you know, taking for granted. I saw those guys in, um, where were they breaking in uh, this week? Magnificent Mountain in Chicago. Did you see them? Oh, my God. They still rising and looting and going on. They know they better than that. Some people are just opportunists, and that is so not good. They make black people look like they got a bad name. But honey, I ain't bad. They don't represent me. We are chosen. We are calling out our tribal members to be of service, continue to help others, continue to pray for others, continue to put God first and pray for this virus that it shall pass us. You remember back in the day when they put the um, blood on the doorpost? Pray without seeking, speak in tongues much. You know, we've got to put on the whole armor of God. And God will cover us because we've got to tell this story the way we want to tell it. And we saw today that Camilla Harris got nominated as the VP candidate. So I want, I know we have some issues with her, but I said when she's there, we've got to renew our minds prayerfully. She will make us proud of her so you know because she is representing us obviously she's smart and the, uh, joe biden can uh, choose her as his running mate i'm sure he consulted with the democrats and, and um, um obama so surely they know more than we know but we need a smart intelligent and articulate fabulous black woman and we need to rally behind them and come out and support them because they are going to help to change these things we need a black woman that ain't scared, you know, but she's, she's humble, and we're going to just pray without ceasing and know that God got it. He has chosen all of us, just like he chose Barack, obviously he chose her. She was running for president, 
So that's probably why he chose her because she is familiar, she's confident, and she is sharp. So I'm gonna be behind her 100%. Y'all register to vote. I'll see you on the on the front line. Woohoo! Okay, so now we're wrapping it up here. We got to run out because the sun is going down. So I have some help here. It's not just me doing this stuff. Okay, so young man, what is your name? Oh, my name is Douglas. Yeah. Douglas, and uh, I'm here. Uh, Carol Wilburn Designs. And uh, we're packing up some food uh, that um, we're distributing uh, to the homeless and trying to um, give something back to the community. And uh, Carol Wilburn Designs is giving back to the community with the little that she has, but in future, we're gonna give more. So we're doing sandwiches, we got uh, crackers over there, uh, we got Soup? some more stuff over here, yeah. stew. Stir so it's a good meal. For the, yeah, the healthy, tasty. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, well, let's stay tuned. We're going to see as y'all grow. So if y'all want to support us, y'all just let us know. We are here to end it, to win it. And we just have to remind everybody to do your part. Absolutely. All right. Absolutely. God bless. Absolutely. Now I can see you. Uh, you're packing up the bread. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and these little bags ended up being small, so mm -hmm. we had to just cut them to make them fit in there. But you know, mm -hmm. if somebody wants to, they can have two. Oh yeah, they can go. They'll go very well with the soup. Yeah, they go with the soup. It's macaroni. It's actually a combination of stir fried chicken with in some tomato sauce with um in, with some noodles in it, and uh, I sauteed some red peppers and uh, garlic and um, good nourishing stuff. Mm -hmm. I would eat it. Awesome. And then I put some in the rice, and I don't eat rice, but I wouldn't eat that one, but it had, uh, you know, stripped chicken and nourishing stuff in there. You just got to get it out there before it's hot. Okay. All right. So anyway, so we'll see you all on the scene. Okay. All right. How many people got there? Okay, do they know? I mean, uh, ask me if they want some food. Uh. We got some raisins too. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are they over there? Bring them up, bring them up. Yeah, ask them if they want some food. Let me get you some bread. A rat run around that damn corner. I bet you get out. I'm gonna bring it. I'm gonna bring it to you. You know, you get a, some crackers, you get some raisins, and a cup of macaroni and chicken uh, okay. mixture. Huh? Okay. Thank you. It's warm, so you may want to eat it. You live close here? I live on Orange. Oh, okay. Right. Thank you, Mama. You are welcome. You want some raisins? No, keep raisins. Okay, great. Thank you. All right, have a blessed evening. You too.